What's up guys, welcome back to another video, Sky here and today we are showcasing NX.GG It's a CS2 cheat, uh, mostly legit cheat but you can also probably semi-rage uh, It's a nice cheat, it's not that expensive and it's still undetected And uh, in today's video I show you how to download it and how to use it And I'll showcase you some of its features So let's get right into that here we have the NX website, nx.gg, and after um, creating an account and redeeming your key, which you can purchase or directly purchasing, uh, you will have this message here. Hello Sky, thank you for supporting our product. Please be careful read the tutorial to inject our CS2 cheat. And you have a hyphen here, how to use plus download. You're going to click that and you're going to see a link. Press on that, the, it should be a mega.ng link. And you're gonna have this folder right here which you're gonna click on download and download as zip file it's gonna download right here so wait for it to download and after that save it wherever you want and open it extract the folder on your desktop which i just did let me drag it here it's gonna look like this and now you're gonna have a few things here you're gonna have a loader, uh, exe file, tutorials and errors. So if you need this, you have a tutorial and some errors explained here, but we won't need this right now, only if you encounter them. If you encounter any problems, obviously the first thing you should do is disable your antivirus as this is a cheat and it could be reported as a false positive. But if not, just run uh, Annex Loader by uh, as an administrator click more info here and run anyway if that thing pops up click yes and it should pop with the um, launcher so it popped up on my other monitor here let's bring it here I already have my username and my password filled in because I tried it but you won't have it just type your username type your password and after that you can click sign in after you click sign in it will say this welcome and you can choose the software version you wish you can choose the free or the premium version i'm going to choose premium because i have it so will you if you purchase it and you're going to click load software when you try to load the cheat you might get an issue like this driver load issue and it says to run their bad file if the error persists so you have two things you have to do here first of all in the annex folder here you find another folder called errors and if you click on this you have a batch file so right click this run it as administrator and as you can see here it's gonna do some things and there's another thing you do if you ever installed face it their anti-cheat is running on your drive and it's protecting it from using the cheat so what you're gonna have to do is click on a uh, search bar and type cmd which is a command prompt and make sure you run it as an administrator when you do that you all have to type sc stop face it this will stop the service name face it in the kernel driver and it won't be protected anymore so after you've done that you can go back here and all you have to do is click load software with the steam open so we're gonna open steam but not open cs2 cs2 should not be opened at the moment of loading if you want to be extra sure you can also um, disable the antivirus by going and writing virus and threat protection then going on virus and threat protection settings and you're gonna turn off real-time protection click yes and it's turned off so now I have Steam opened on my other monitor and I'm going to click load software. It's going to say loading. And I'm going to pull the command prompt here. You can see it. It should say driver loaded when everything is fine. And after that, it should close. Now you're going to wait. Another one will open and this one should be waiting for the game. The game will automatically open by itself. If not, you should open it manually. But we're gonna wait for the game and I'm gonna be back in a second. Alright, so as you can see I'm back, I'm in the game and if you press insert you can see the annex.dg interface. You have 
here for legit options, aimbot, trigger bot, recall system and you can do it different settings for each weapon or do it globally from here. Obviously you can get configs on their website and you don't need to actually um, make it yourself but um, I'm just gonna show you that if I keep the um, you can see the aimbot working dragging my uh, crosshair to the um, a guy obviously you can change the smooth here if you put it to zero it's gonna go directly onto it it's not gonna be first shot obviously it's gonna be second because this is a legit cheat it's not a rage cheat so it's not automatically do it but obviously you can as well do this so find configs on the website if you want i'm just gonna show you the features this was aimbot you also have visuals which the default config comes with uh, some visuals enabled here obviously you can do it for your liking we have miscellaneous things like watermark um, damage timer hit marker sounds and uh, custom crosshair you can make your own custom crosshair if you want the web radar is a thing it's very nice you can give to your teammates which don't play with cheats the radar of the enemies are uh, revealed so you can enable it, give it a frame rate, and you're gonna get a URL, so a web address, which you can give to your friends in the match. You also have grenade tape helper, which uh, not only shows you where the grenade will go, but you can also create macros and configs for them, which I think it's amazing. Then we have the global configs, so you can create your own config or get some configs from someone else, and you also have global settings like sensitivity, stream proof if you want it not to be seen um, on OBS if you want to play with cheats and uh, record but this is not the point now and also you can skip animations and show the debug info you have snake here for when you die and want to relax although you won't die very often with this shit and also you have command bot you can purchase um, balance from here and command accounts anyways this is annex.gg and i'm sure you're gonna find the features very nice when you will use it yourself i'm not gonna go too into depth in this uh, i hope you like the video please like and subscribe if i helped you today and i hope you'll have tons of fun with this cs2 cheat thank you for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video bye